What's going on? Don Harry McCann's here, Pro Pop, on his personal channel. Hail to the Redskins. They won a big game last night. This is Chance. Awesome job. Got some special guys on that team. Rookies. So hopefully they have a bright future. But I'm not here to talk about the Redskins. Today, speaking of highlights, because that's what has been occurring for this week. Oh, guys, guy sent me some highlights. Now, from the football perspective, your highlight tape should be that. Your highlights, not a long, drawn-out, continuous um, of you playing football, unless you're just that bad of a boy. If you, every play, you scoring touchdowns, making big hits, uh, you know, playing football to the uh, elite level every play, then yeah. But for the most part, each game, you're probably going to get two or three major highlights, and that's what you want to highlight in your film. You want your film to be at least three or five minutes, if not less. Ten, fifteen minutes, the reality of it is, unless you're really impressive, people are going to stop watching it. So that being said, for those guys who are trying to get ready for school and get people um, and scouts looking at them because they may not, you know, been on a team where they can, uh, you know, soldiers, so... Right now, social media is the way to do it. So the YouTubes, the Facebooks, um, t Tumblr, something like that. Um, any way you can put your videos because that's kind of the way of the future. Uh, scouts are clicking buttons nowadays. Um, I know a couple guys who talk to and, you know, from each level of getting closer to these athletes and seeing these athletes at a faster rate so they don't have to spend their money and travel and go see somebody who isn't worth it. So that being said, within your highlight film, if you catch a ball and you're a receiver, it's not necessarily a highlight. You want outrageous catches, difficult catches, catches over the shoulders, abnormal stuff. Um, my highlight film, personally, is kind of boring. Until they realize every play that I put on a film, I was scoring. So that being said, they were like, okay, well, what do you do besides run straight? I score. So that became, you know, the attraction. Every time this guy touched the ball, he was scoring a touchdown, be it five yards, be it 90 yards. So that being said, I had at least two receivers send me takes or send me, you know, their uh, stuff online, and they were just catching the ball. That's great that you can catch, but as a receiver, that's what you're supposed to do. Catch the ball. So as a running back, if you're running back, just hitting the hole and, you know, making five or six yards, eh, that may be good. But you want to run over a few people, make some big breaks, shake a couple people up. Um, you, you you want people saying, ooh, ah, or better yet, if you ever watched that, uh, that commercial. Hello. That's what you want. That's what you need in your highlight film. You want to be attractive. Why are they coming to see you? Because everybody can play football. That's why they don't feel each region is going to be different from the south to the north to the east. But for the most part, wherever you are, you have to stand out. That's what ends up happening. You have to say, this is my highlight, and this is how I get it done. This is what I can do when given an opportunity. opportunity. I know some teams around here, these teams are loaded and stacked. So we got several guys who... Um, who didn't get the opportunity. And that's where my personal training business comes in as well. Because what I'll do is, we'll get you on film. We'll have you on film as far as highlights in the game. But we'll show you strength. We'll show you speed. We'll show you agility through the drills that I've already contacted different scouts on what they look for. And it's the same, for, for the most part, very simple and basic drills. But how do you attack them? Your body language speed, your times. That plays a major part because you got to understand about a lot of these drills. Most of these drills are based on how do I eliminate people because you have a million people who want to play football at the next level, be it from high school to college or college to the pros. So how do I eliminate people? And that's how you do it. If you're not putting up amazing film or putting up crazy numbers, 
fun to reconsider your highlight. Okay, or even some guys who play multiple positions. That's the highlight. Where you can go from quarterback to wide receiver to running back. Then go over and play DB, safety, linebacker. It shows your, your, your diversity. It shows your ability that you can step on the field and play football. Because the bottom line is, can you play football? And that's from the football perspective. Basketball and other sports. And today, it's about the numbers. How do I impress? the person watching this film. And you have to do it fast. You can't have a long, drawn-out highlight tape. Do more power to you. But for the most part, keep it three to five minutes. Get in, get out, get your point across. Height, weight, size, positions. And um, the reality of it, if you're going to do all the music and stuff, scouts really don't care. Because what if you're sending it to the country and you got hip-hop on it? Or if you got hip hop on and you sit and you know and they don't like hip hop. So what is the purpose of the music? You wanna show your tape, show what you can do, let them be impressed, and you know, hopefully they give you a phone call or bring you in for a visit. Um, that's the goal. So from my perspective, what I went through, any questions, comments, please leave them. Um, I am Donary McCants, profile performance personal training. Hail to the Redskins. Until next time, man.